This is me, Elizabeth. When the coronavirus hit the U.S., life as we knew it was on permanent pause. This, of course, included the entertainment industry. In order to keep my extroverted self somewhat sane during this time, I turned to technology for help. I reconnected with new and old friends, family members, and acquaintances from all over the country. What started out as a project to keep myself busy turned into something so much more. During the month of April, I was able to speak to 34 individuals and decided to turn my side project into this video. It was, it was uh, pretty uh, quiet. Like a ghost town here, except for the line at Trader Joe's. It's a crazy time. Really thrown into this virus. Do I have it? Too hard to breathe. Getting no taste or smell. It's scary. It's really scary. A lot of people died because of this. Lost my mom to it. The coronavirus. And everything down. It's, it's weird because um, there's like nobody here. There's nobody on the roads, no school. For the gym. Um, a lot of smaller businesses are probably not going to be around anymore. I'm an essential employee. On the front lines with the boys of sanitation. So I'm a teacher. I'm a teacher. I'm a pharmacist. I uh, work with Homeland Security. I am a nurse. nurse. A content creator. We typically see children in a clinic. We work for the New York State WIC program. I'm in nursing schools. Um, I have been a performer. I am a photographer. Work for the Food Network. And director of operations for a professional development department. I work for an insurance company. I do special investigations. A print manager at uh, one of the big universities in the city. I'm in the gift industry in sales. Uh, ER was crazy. We're seeing a lack of testing. We are reusing gowns. Basically all of our patients are COVID. My floor was a designated COVID floor for two weeks. Yeah, we got uh, coronavirus shifts cleaning the the garages constantly, the trucks constantly. The grocery store. They're one of the most uh, densely packed, which is actually deemed an essential service right now. So people are staying home and social distancing. But I am alone. I'm making sure everyone's safe and healthy, but working from home until further notice. Plenty of Zoom conference calls. So I spent a lot of time with my computer, quality time with my computer inside. The remote learning get acclimated to this lifestyle. Some some days are very different than what we're used to. It's this new normal. Trying to keep myself sane. There would be days that I would go, uh, I don't know really what I did today. I've been reading. I'm also cooking a lot. Crush some home workouts. And working on some puzzles. And Lots of walking and hiking. I have picked up crafting. Homemade cards for people. Working on a a musical with my husband and, and watch as much netflix as i can i guess i mean who knows when so we're all we're all in the house together i'm so excited to see my friends I just really want to go out and have some fun to go out to breakfast and to go out to dinner and to hug people spend as much time with my family as i can follow the guidelines in order to stop the spread remember if you stay home you stay safe and you save lives there will be a light at the end of the tunnel.